Welcome to the third part of the False Friends series where I'm going to show you some words that in English and in Spanish don't mean the same. They are very similar when you write them, but they don't mean the same. Okay, so come and see. The first word is facilities. Facilities is not something easy. We, we, we commonly use this in Spanish when we want to make a payment. For example, let's say, oh, I bought a new car and they gave me facilities to pay the car. No, facilities, no, it's not facilidades. Facilities mean a group or a structure, a building where a company or a school has their offices or their classroom. For example, here in Inglés Individual, we have big facilities for you to come and enjoy your sessions and your conversation clubs, okay? It's not facilidades, remember. Constipated. Constipated in Spanish would be when I'm sick and, <coughs> and I can't speak too well because instead of saying Manuel, I say Baduel. It means that my, my nose is full and I'm sick. No, constipated means when, when you can't go to the bathroom, when you can't defecate. That's constipated. Constipado in Spanish or in English, it would be to have a cold. Terrific. Actually, this is one of the words that mean completely the opposite thing. While terrific in English means something really, really well, in Spanish it's not something very funny or really well done because terrific in English means something very well done. Like, hey, awesome, you did a terrific job in that interview. Terrific would be something really good, but in Spanish, terrorifico would be terrifying. Like, oh my God, that movie was so terrifying. Or horrifying, you would say. Terrifying or horrifying, but not terrific. Terrific. It means something very good. Conductor, this is very common to be confused because in Spanish, a conductor or conductor means the person who is driving the, the car or the Uber car. You don't say, oh, my, my Uber conductor. No, you say my Uber driver, driver. The conductor would be the person who is in front of an orchestra. Okay, he's the one that does this and guides all the violins and all the flutes and the drums. Or it could also mean a material that conducts electricity. Okay, it doesn't mean the person who is driving. The person who is driving means driver. And the last one for this part would be college. College in Spanish would be a school, yes, but only for elementary or high school or junior high school. While in English is not colegio, College means university, it's not colegio. So if you want to say colegio, you say school. But if you want to say university, you say college. College means university. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I'm Juanjo. Remember to comment if you have any more doubts or any more words that you might get confused with when you're speaking or practicing your English.